before. I'm going to try to push the uh, the the uh, goo in the direction of the crack. You're able to kind of manipulate the goo uh, to a point where it's uh, sort of sitting in the crack. Um, and at this point, the goo starts to almost spaz out. It, it can't find. Uh, it can't find a position to where it can actually form into an orb, so it seems to be sort of rolling on top of itself uh, and falling back into the crack. It, it almost it's like stuck in this uh, endless cycle of rolling and, and falling into a crack. Mm. All right. I feel sorry for it. No. No, fuck it. The jerk. Um, do we have anything we can cover this crack with? Not really. I'm going to throw one of the monster's corpses on top of it. On the demon corpses. The crack's not big enough to fit the entire orb. It's, it's like the... Orb I, just is want, sticking... I just want a tiny part in there. I'm not trying to get the whole thing. Yeah, the whole, yeah, it's a tiny part of the orb in there. So what are you trying to do again? I'm just trying to cut... There's a tiny part of the goo in there, and I want to put uh, one of the demon's bodies on top of it. Uh, okay, you put the demon body on top of the... Crack. Crack, and the orb uh, forms around it. Uh, eventually, it's still trying to... Uh, make an orb shape out of itself. Now well, it's part of it's at least stuck in a crack right now. But yes, you think it is. I mean, it's yeah. it's it's a viscous thing, so it could. Yeah. You know. Okay. What if we were to take some sort of a sheet and wrap it around the orb and try and pulling it? <laughs> it might just go through the it sheet. Might it might just, just go it. straight through the. Right. At this point, at this point, if the white orb does what we think it does and it destroys the area around it, it might take out this tower with it. At the very least, we've stopped the that mass of goblins from reforming. So I think we've done what we can with this tower. I think we should probably yeah. move on to the other tower. Let's try hitting up the white tower. All right, let's go oh, this uh, way. Okay, did you guys want to break for the night? Or do you want to keep going? I'm good to keep going. The rest of you good? I'm good. All right. I'm just checking. That's all. Yeah. All right. Let's go stealth like. Sneak and do, we'll do, do it from the opposite way. Just you know, parallel. Uh, alrighty. I need you guys to make each make one stealth check, and we'll use that. Ah, oh, shit. What is my stealth again? Why do I forget these things? Huh. I ask you to make a shit ton of rolls. Yes. And get stuck in here. <laughs> yes. Dirt checked. All right. So I did. Off. Only for Dotha, though. 25. I got a 4. I am a ghost. Dotha and, uh... Oh, I could be, like, piggybacking on Dothar's back right now when no one sees us. <laughs> <laughs> we, like, I, I seriously should have just said I'm broke. Dothar and Dahl are able to uh, easily um, traverse the, uh, the grounds. While uh, while the other guys are slowed a bit by trying to be extra extra careful not to uh, step on anything that makes a lot of sounds while they're going right in front of a door, um, nothing seems to happen though as you skillfully uh, cross the grounds towards the other side of the uh, oh, excuse me towards the other um, tower. Uh, look, are there arrow slits in this one too? Uh, similar, yes. Can I see anything on the inside, or going through to the other side? This one appears that they're across on the other side, and on the inside there appear to be uh, there appear to be moving bodies. On the inside, there are moving bodies. Inside and on the outside, at the other side. Ooh. So, so the other one was probably more like like a pen, like a pen for that one animal, for that thing, mass, whatever the fuck it was. It's called Jojo. Okay. For Jojo. Well, we could try doing it the same thing we did the other one, though. Same yeah. pairs, or... Yeah, that's... Sounds fine. Uh, I'm good. All right, Donald, do you want to go up this more narrow alley with me, or do you want to go around the right-hand no, side? I'm going to go, I guess, this way. I don't know. It's up to you. All right. Mm. Do any of you have dailies left? I have a daily I have, left. I have a, I have, I have a use. <laughs> I've got one daily left. Uh, which way are, are you guys going? Are we all going to go one way or what? I was just going to go this way because it's the way I was closest to. Alright, I'm going to go up this side. Alright, the me and Dothra will go and John and Greg will go. I have, uh, I have one daily left. 
Mm-hmm. Same here. All right. So roll initiatives. Uh, hold on, and let me set the thing up. I, I just want you to be able to see everything, what's going on first. But okay. yeah, go ahead, roll your initiatives, and then add it to the list, please. All right. Aww. All right, John, you... You, you get the plus, plus you get the plus, three. You get the plus three this time. Oh, wow, 17. 22. It's the scat man. Get it really good, really good, really good, really good, really good. My poo tastes really good. And um just so I do we I'll do it now, but you guys have a and you guys have a thing of boppers. Fourteen, okay. I'm just uh I'm just adding initiative to them now, uh, but they don't see you. Okay. Do 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 do. All right, let's move. Alrighty, you see four shadowy figures moving inside the uh, um, inside the tower, and I can't see my netbook, so I can't see what the hell's going on. Uh, John. John, it's your turn. All right, I will. Go ahead and click the wrong button, and then go there. I'm going to activate Umbral Curtain before I move, <laughs> and then move up to here. Go through, and then doll. Okay, John. Okie dokie. Whoever's after me. That would be me. Dotha! Bum 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 bandit! Now it belongs to Dal! Bum 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 da 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 Stop right, Jordan of the Corner. And now it's Greg who sees nothing around the corner except a door. Alright. Dother. Go right ahead. And then Doll will go. I have my challenge great sword out. <laughs> he has his challenge great sword out. <laughs> John, go ahead and knock down the door. Dome. I don't know, we got a guy in Umbral Curtain. I might go ahead and let him do some recon work. So I'm gonna go hide here. Greg, you will make yourself useful. Okay. One, two, three, four, two. Okay. Work the musical. Alright, so first and foremost, I'm going through the door. I'm, I'm looking to see if there is a locking mechanism on the inside and if the door is locked. Uh, there is a locking mechanism on the inside. The door is not locked. Okay. I'll keep note of that. And I look around and look at the shadows there. Hmm. Yep, Scary. Oh, that's fun. Dother! Sneaky, 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 sneaky. Sneaky, 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 sneaky. Okay, I'll get in position right there. Dahl made his move, and it now was a John good one. shall go. I will move here and wait for the word from Greg. Greg shall teleport again through the wall, and he will demystify. Yes, and then I demystify, not of the book, say, doors, say, doors unlocked, pull the bow, knock an arrow, and I say, okay. You're not pulling a bullet back or knocking an arrow because it's still. Okay. Surprise round. Surprise round. Uh, Dother. All right. Well, um. Plus, you forgot to do it in song. <laughs> uh, I think that I will actually hold my action here. So. Doll. I'm going to look towards Greg and John and see if they want me to open the door. 
I nod. I give the thumbs up. All right, I'm going to push the door open. And then push I'll drop the door my open. and then I'll drop my hold right after his action. Okay, so uh, so now I go at the bottom of the round. Yep. All right. Uh, so the door's open. Door's open. Your turn. All right, I'll open up the attacks. Then I will use hand of radiance on shadows one, three, and four. Okay. This is against their reflex. So twenty-eight. 24 and 28. Hit, hit, hit. All right, they all take nine radiant damage. Radiant, if that does any difference, because they're shadowy and it's lighty. Okie dokie. Uh, it is John's turn. Are we out of surprise rounds now? Yeah, we're on. Uh, we're on full out attack mode now. All right, I will attack Shadow Numero Uno. With, um, you know, we'll go with uh, just a normal crush, crushing surge. Twenty-seven. Uh, that is a hit. Nine. <laughs> you swing at the shadow with your flail, and it seems it seems to go through the shadow as if it almost took no damage at all. Whoa. Stick with the light attacks. Greg, your turn. Okay, um, make my bow nice and fiery again, uh, knock back an arrow, and I'm going to implore Dahl to race the arrow and attack Shadow 2. So and I miss. Away. You miss completely. Doesn't that, you're not going to do anything, don't worry. Okay. <laughs> the Can shadows. Go. I'm going to move back here. <laughs> Shadow 1 takes out... His hand comes out, comes to fruition, and it looks like a staff forms out of its hand, and it's going to attack you, John. 19 against AC, it's not going to do a fucking thing. Fuck you. Shadow 2 is going to come up here to John, and then, uh, actually it's going to come up from... What's its intelligence? Wait, 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 what's its intelligence? Oh, no, it's intelligent, alright. It's going to... Oh, well, it's smart. Well, it's, yeah, it's going to go do, do that. And it's going to go, I'm going to attack you now! Ugh! With his horn. Spear thing. (laughs) Critical fail! And, uh, speed of... Oh, yes. Oh, well, I can't do that. Well, I can do that, though. I can get kind of up there. And the shadow is going to again attack you, since you're the only thing in the room, and go... Uh, that's actually a 30-29... Well, it hits, I think. It hits, John. Okay. Yeah. Alrighty, you were going to take... Four damage. Um, alrighty, you take untyped uh, 12 damage and... Next. 7 necrotic damage. Oh, boy. And then Shadow 4 is going to be like, hello. Uh-oh. And it's going to attack you. It's a 22, John. No. I don't think it's going to hit John. No, it is not. Poopy! Well then! Um. Okay, uh, Dahl, your turn. I'm gonna go up here and I'm going to use Mace Tail's Rage. 27 against AC. It's a hit. It's going to do 15 damage. I gain 5 temporary hit points for hitting. So let me do that real quick. Hey, uh, that's the only one that has to take damage. Yes, so he's also going to take an additional 2 damage then for challenge seeking. And then I'm going to minor swift to my life drinker's long so- or great sword. Okay. And I will um end my turn there. All righty then, Doser, make it awesome. All right, I'm going to move down here. And I will cast Falling Leaves. Oh. Centered on John, so this is going to catch all four of them. Okay. Alright, uh, this is against Reflex once again. So let's do one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Oh my god! Fourth one misses. Oh! You should do oh. yourself an accuracy. Oh, an accuracy. Do you roll it? Yes! <laughs> Fourth one hits. Go, 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 go! 19 radiant damage to all of them. And if they end their next turn adjacent to an ally, they take another 5 radiant damage. Ooh, okay. Interesting. 